Oh, would you look at this guy? It's such a cute little home. Let's dive in. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to the 339th episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show. I'm your host, James Wise. You are watching Holton Wise TV. And this is the show where I work with you guys one-on-one -on -one to help you start, build, or grow your real estate portfolios. Guys, I'm going to help you identify properties like this little guy that might be a, a diamond in the rough and then my team will help you do the property management, the maintenance, the construction, the insurance, the title work, the whole nine. And even when you're done investing, you no longer want to be in the game, you want to exit, want to move on to other stuff, we will sell the property for you again right here on Holton Wise TV. Today I'm working with my man Andy. And folks, real quick, if you want to work with me in the same way Andy is doing, send an email to sales at holtonwise.com. Give us your phone number. We'll let you know how the process works. Works. We also have more info in the show notes below. Andy, though, I want to talk to you now, brother. You are a balls-to-the-wall, high-risk, high-reward type investor. I love that about you, but I don't want you to go <laughs> for broke all the time, bro, okay? I, I think you're working with, like, I think you said, like, $150,000, $160,000 in cash, which is great. You have a really good, high-paying W-2 job, right? You're a pharmacy manager out there on the West Coast, right? So you have a lot of money coming in. You sound like you're a fairly young dude, right? So you're not afraid of the high risk stuff, right? I just filmed a video for you where the house is a hoarder house. It's just totally destroyed, right? That's, you know, a higher risk investment, right? This one though, this is definitely a lower risk investment. The neighborhood, this is a C grade neighborhood. And then the house itself uh, is in much better shape, right? It's just a small little two one, but you know, these, these things, they're earners, which by the way, just so you know, like, I know this room looks pretty badass, but uh, they did, like, a virtual staging here, right? So, like, I, this coffee table, this rug, this couch, that light, and these photos, these are not actually there, okay? They did uh, some type of virtual staging. We get uh, listing agents who've been doing that quite often, okay? So just so you know, that stuff is not actually real. Just want to make sure you're aware. But, you know, the house looks like it's in pretty good shape. Like, dude, look at this kitchen. You know, pretty solid, man. Like... Again, more virtual staging, like this bed not actually there, uh, this one not actually there. Uh, so, you know, I wish they wouldn't have done as much virtual staging. makes it a little hard, but it looks like everything is pretty much rent ready. We have a hot water tank that's probably around 10 years old, so you probably have another five years out of that. This hot uh, furnace has definitely seen some better days. You're starting to see some rusting, all right, some discoloration up here. So this is probably around 20 years old. When you have to replace these, uh, it costs about $3,000. You usually get about 30 years out of these. So do I think we probably need to replace it tomorrow? No. I bet you'll have a few years out of this thing. But I just want you to be aware uh, that this is probably getting towards the end of its life cycle. But other than that, just like a solid little home, dude. And what we could do with this, which, by the way, the address is 308 Clinton Avenue, Lyria 44035. And it just hit the market four days ago. So I do kind of want you to move quick, right? Because I think this will move, right? We put a Section 8 tenant in here, bro. We're going to put them in there at 900 a month. That's 10800 a year. We should kick off an anticipated NOI of 5448 And on top of that 5448 Andy, you got to remember... I am saving $660 of that, right? So you're going to get that money back on top of your estimated uh, NOI of 5448, right? But 660 is probably going in your pocket right now. And you're saving that because that furnace is going to need replaced in a few years, right? That hot water tank's probably got about five years left. The roof is probably in the last 10 years of its life. That's probably a four or $5,000 roof, right? So you're saving for that stuff. You're also saving for your vacancy and your repairs and maintenance, right? So, as far as price goes, they listed this thing at $39.9. This is why I think it's going to move quick. I think that's a pretty solid price. Are you a lender? If so, Holton Wise is looking to partner with you. If you're licensed in all 50 states, go to HoltonWise.com. Click the digital media tab to advertise on Holton Wise TV today. 
with anything, I think we should try to negotiate a little bit. So I say we try to pick it up at 38000 If we could pick it up at 38000 we don't have to do much to get you a tenant. That's a 14.3 cap. And if you finance it, that's a 42.2% return on your money. Estimated, right? But here's the thing. I just do need you to understand. I'm looking at it right now from these photos. Yeah, they're virtually staged. It looks pretty solid, and I can't really point out any major renovations we need to do. That said, uh, don't, like, bank on that 42% uh, estimated return because I'm sure after we get the inspector in there, number one, and then number two, my maintenance team gets in there for the safety check. Uh, to verify it meets our rent-ready standards. And then if we go the Section 8 route, when the Section 8 inspector actually gets in there, I would be shocked if after all three of those inspections, they don't find at least a few thousand dollars of stuff we got to do to button this thing up. So just bear that in mind, right? But I'm going off of limited information. But all things told, bro, it looks like a pretty solid deal. Now, I know it's not one of those, you know, crazy high-return bird deals, but you don't have to try to do those all the time, right? You got to stagger that stuff, right? You should should want to do big projects like that but while that project's being performed right you ain't making no money right so you got to stagger that with stuff like this where it's pretty much you know ready to go right we're going to do a few things to this most likely and then that cash flow is going to start coming in while you're handling those bigger projects right because that's money coming out of your pocket this is money going into your pocket so i wanted to show this one to you to compare and contrast it with that bigger burr investment that i sent you so Reply to the private email letting me know your thoughts on this one if you want to make an offer on it. Uh, if you don't, just give me your feedback of why you don't think it's going to make sense for you. And when I start doing other videos for you, I will take that into account and we will adjust. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.